Bam! We made it. What's up, familia? Welcome inside the pad. Hope you guys are doing good. Keeping between the lines. Got your load secure. All right, man. We made it. 2021 is behind us now. Here we are, the start of 2022. Congratulations to everybody that made it, man. We're all here. And, um, you know, 2021 is now in the rearview mirror, man. All it is is a memory now. And uh, we could just look forward to what we can do here this year in 2022, right? Um, eventually, 2022 will be a memory, just like 2021 is today. Thing is, what memory is that going to be? What accomplishment is going to be here this year, 2022? Okay. Most, uh, most people I talk to, I don't really like to use the word uh, resolution because it just turns people off, homes. Serio. But I tell them, like, hey, what do you want to do this year? Like, what do you want to accomplish? And they're like, ah, I don't do any of that. I don't do New Year resolutions. They never work out. Nah, I don't do one. I don't do all that stuff, man. Making it seem like if they're the only ones that don't do it. Well, nah, child, because most of the people that I talk to, they don't do them. Now, I just want to say when it doesn't work out. That says something about you and your character. Because you're supposed to make it work. One or two things. Either you set it way too high where you set yourself up for failure. Or there's a lack of determination on following through with it. So, I want to go ahead and challenge everybody this year. Here we are, the beginning of 2022. Hey, we're all here. We all made it, right? I want to go ahead and challenge you guys to do something. Something that's really going to help, okay? Now, the big thing is, oh, man, I want to lose weight. I want to get back in shape. I want to do this. I want to do that. You get gym membership. You're in there for like the first two months, maybe three months, and then you just kind of fall off. And, ah, you know what? Life got in the way and all this kind of stuff. And then next thing you know, man, you're not even in the gym anymore. You're not working out. Nothing happened. It's just, bam, right back. So, I want to go ahead and challenge everybody this year. Okay. I got my own New Year resolutions that I got going on. All right, but I'm gonna throw some out there, and hopefully, uh, hopefully, some of you guys, you know, take me up on it. All right, because my New Year resolutions that I'm gonna throw out there to you guys doesn't require your guys' time. It doesn't require money. It doesn't require for you to get a membership. It doesn't require for you guys to do anything. To tell you the truth. Here's what I'm going to say. Here's what I'm going to throw out there to you guys. Fast. Don't eat. Fast. Pick one that you truly think that you can do. Whether it be 16 hours, 24 hours, 36 hours, so on and so forth. This year, 2022, I'm going to fast one day out of the month now. I ain't going to lie, man. I uh, Last year, 2021, right? It wasn't my new resolution to be fasting. But I kind of just thought to myself, like, hey, I'm just going to incorporate this into my life. You know, fasting back in 2020 when I was doing it. And then 2021 came and I probably fasted like, four or five times in the whole year. I didn't incorporate it into my life the way I really wanted it to. So for this year, I'm going back on it. I'm fasting one day out of the month. Two of the months, 
out of this year, I'm going to fast for 48 hours. One of those months, I'm going to fast for 72 hours. All the other months, I'm fasting for 24 hours. Okay, that, that's not requiring your guys' time. That's not requiring any money. That's not requiring any membership. That's not requiring anything. That's requiring health. You see, we throw so much junk into our system, man. We don't allow our bodies to do what it needs to do. Our body can really do so many great things, but we don't allow it to. Because we continually keep throwing junk in our system. There's a lot of clutter and garbage all inside of us. And it continues to stay there. And you guys can watch commercials about, hey, take this pill, take that pill. It'll clean your system out. It'll do this, it'll do that. Charlie, your system itself will clean itself out if you allow it to. But you got to allow your body to do its work. One day out of the month. Again, to each their own, whatever level you're at. If you just want to do it for 16 hours, hey, feed them and do it for 16 hours. If you want to step up your game a little bit and do a little bit more, hey, a toa madre, handle. Your body is there to work to help you, but you're not letting it help you. That doesn't require anything. I'm just saying, don't eat for so many hours. Don't eat. Another one I'm going to throw out there to you guys. Okay? Take one cold shower every three months. One cold shower. Again, that's not requiring anything you're gonna take a shower anyway unless you don't shower if you don't shower homie then i'm then i'm asking you to take a shower hey homes if you guys don't shower then i'm asking you to take a shower okay but if you already shower then i'm just asking one day out of three months that's four cold showers in one year make it cold one in three months make it cold now I'll tell you guys all the benefits that I hear about cold showers okay I hear about it's good for the skin it's good for the hair it's good for the immune system it's good for the blood flow and so on and so forth I don't know if any of that's true I can't tell you if any of that's true I don't know but what I will tell you is whatever kind of day I had, the weight that was on my shoulders, whatever was on my mind, whatever stresses came with that day, when I jump in that cold shower, it all washes off of me. It washes all off of me, man. That weight just goes down the drain, along with the stress, everything else that went through that day, Everything, man, it all just washes off of me and goes down the drain. So I'm just saying one cold shower every three months, man. Every quarter, one. If, if, hey, man, if you want to step it up after that, hey, like I said, I thought I'm either handle your business. Okay, that's the challenge I'm throwing out there to you guys. Again, man. That is not requiring you guys working out and, you know, giving here and giving there and, and, and finances or anything like that. No, no, none of that stuff, man. Fast. And take a cold shower. Okay. For so long, man. For so long. Hente have been suffering with health issues. Okay, we do not talk about our health. Now, the cold shower, hey, man, I don't know what comes with the health. Maybe all that stuff is true. Maybe it is. I don't know. I can't tell you it is that or it isn't. 
I'm just telling you personally what it does. Whatever stress, whatever's on my mind, every anything, man, it just washes off of me. Okay, if all that other stuff comes with it, hey, dog, that's cool. It's feeding me. I don't know. I can't see my blood flow. But the fasting, I can't tell you. That does help. Okay, there's all these, you know, diets and don't eat this, don't eat that. Man, we all know what's good, what's bad, and all that stuff, workout. We all know all that stuff, man. But how many people actually truly do it? How about this? Don't do anything. Fast. Requires you just to really do nothing. Stay away from the food for a while. Let your body do its job. So, familia, that's my challenge out there to you guys in YouTube Landia. Shout out to my boy Mike Diaz for that uh, phrase right there. Um, for this year. Okay, and if it doesn't happen at the end of this year, that's because you didn't make it happen. Because it doesn't require your time. It doesn't require money. It doesn't require you climbing up a mountain. It doesn't require you doing something extra. It doesn't require any of that. And don't, you know, every time I talk about fasting and everything, it's like, oh man, when I don't eat, uh, you know, I get a headache. Like, get out of here, man. There's people around the world that are really looking for food because they will literally, literally die. Okay, you can do it. Okay, these things require really just determination, dedication from you. That's it. Nothing more. So, here we are, 2022, familia. Let's hit it strong, man. Let's hit it strong because, hey, look. Like I said, 2021 is nothing but a memory now, right? Okay, here we are in the beginning of 2022. At some point, it's just going to be nothing but a memory. Soon, we will be in Christmas time of 2022. What do you want to look back and say, hey, I accomplished this. I did this. I made this happen. It starts now. It starts now. This is the start line. It's not a sprint, it's a marathon. But you will get to the finish line if you stick to it. Let's get to the finish line. All right? Hey, much love, familia. Hey, here we go, 2022, man. Let's tear it up. You know what? 2021, uh, there was a lot of good things, at least for me personally, man. But uh, 2022, let's really, uh, let's really make some noise, familia, all right? And uh, I really want everybody to jump on board with this. If, it's, if you don't, hey, it's all right. It's all good, homes. All right? Do your thing, man. But set some sort of goal for yourself. So at the end of the year, you can look back and say, hey, I did something and I accomplished it. Remember, okay, challenge yourself, but don't shoot too high thinking that, uh, you know, setting yourself up for failure pretty much. But don't shoot too low either. That's why I'm saying, hey, fast one day a month. One day a month. Pick one day. And to your level. Cold shower. Hey man. Once every three months, man. You get you can do that. You can do that. Alright? Hey, here we are in the new year. Man, 2022. Let's tear it up. As always, familia, live your life like you're on the road. Be aware of your surroundings and always keep a safe distance. Blood makes you related, but loyalty makes you family. Until next time, this is the Total Trucker. Over and out.